All right. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Woda. Welcome back to this stream. Um, so we are going to play a small game that I already heard about that was on my watch list for quite a while. This is supposed to be not a crappy game. Um, the art style is right up my alley. It's something which is relaxing. Um, because we need, we need relaxation. That, that's all that we need. And the game is called <laughs> Memories of Old. So let's try this out. I've not done anything yet. I think it's a platformer. Ooh, if you're on the edge of the thing, it doesn't like it quite much. Can I make it? Yes. Yes. And I cannot click it. Brilliant. <laughs> Little things in life. Um, Oak. Okay, there are going to be all three letters names, R and D. That, that is going to be the gist of the game, right? Everybody is going to be called ABC. D, E, F, and often a combination of consonants so you can pronounce it like, oh, only vowels. So you go, yeah, or, or whatever in between. Um, yeah, I should avoid doing that because otherwise I'm going to project a little bit too much on my um, beautiful mic. Oh, listen, I know you're eager to explore, but the pilgrimage is important to the people of the sky. As you know, in the early days before the Great Divide, it's... Okay, this is going very much for a, a Zelda vibe. The lands were very different from now. Instead of islands in the skies, the lands were one, and the ancient inhabited the world. They built great structures, among them three temples. Here in the lands of gods, your journey will lead you to all three of them. Okay. But something changed. The ancients somehow caused the great divide, shattered the lands and left us with, uh, with islands in the skies. Um, in the sky. God damn it, read correctly. The priestess Kara prayed by the lighthouse and found answers that helped all people survive the great cataclysm. The first stop for every pilgrim is to visit Kara Shrine, so go on in, Oak. I will wait for you outside. W S A D move. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, there is. There's a little bit of stutter to this. I don't know if you see exactly the same thing I'm seeing, but. Oh, God. Oh, God. Let's try to V sync it. Because usually I don't V sync it. Does that help? No, it doesn't help. It's really in the animation. All, otherwise, everything is very fluid, but... I, it's just like you need to be in person to really see it, I think. I don't know if you can see that on stream. That is... That is rough. That is very rough. Okay, I can jump. Yeah, it looks like she's like 3 FPS when the rest of the animation is just like completely fluid. Even the camera is moving a little bit weird. Oh, interesting. Ooh, fire. Oh, yeah. Okay, at least the dynamic lightning is kind of cool. I'm kind of bummed out. I didn't expect that thing to have that many problems. Ooh, read. I like to read. This tablet is really worn. A part of the text is unreadable. In the land of gods, there were three, in three houses, slumbering in eternal skies. All right. 
Oof. <laughs> well, eh, he's having a little bit of a slideshow moment now. Oh boy. It's sad because the art style is really cool. The music is great too. The memory of light in our hearts, shining with the name of Kara. Her lent had guided and protected us when the world shattered and we became the people of the sky. Okay. So the priestess is there to help us. I'm expecting that they have a sort of small tutorial area. Um, oh, is that a fox? That kind of looks like a fox. E, e. Let me just try and window for a second. See if it just helps. I'm not sure that OBS. No. It's really internal to the engine. I, I do apologize for that. Um, there's unfortunately nothing I can do. Um, I hope at least the stream quality is good. Oh, I can go down a bit. Uh, is there anything to be seen down there? It doesn't seem so. Okay, we can get up. Enter the Hall of Memory, where sleeps the light of Kara. It never went out while she was alive. Ask, and maybe it will shine forth to answer you. Alright, so we need to pray to the priestess. Oh man. Okay, visually, this has something. Some whispers in the wind. Those guys seems to be not... Well, time to get the fuck out of here then. I run. Alright. Uh, cool. Uh, that direction might be better. Man, that looked like... Almost like a giant robot. Can I even... Yeah, I need to keep on going. Oh. I hope this lantern will be long enough to guide the young pilgrim. Well, uh, you know what? I kind of hope also they are going to burn long enough. Perfectly relaxing. Everything is good. Everything is fine. Everything is gonna be alright. Don't worry about a thing. Ooh. Achievement, the light in the tunnel. Oh, okay. So it's going a little bit mm. better outside. Oak, you made it out okay. Thank the gods you're alright. What happened in there? I thought the worst when the cave collapsed. Is that the lantern? Hmm. Strange. That lantern is ancient is an ancient artifact called Kara's Light. 
Somehow it shines for you. It's the first times in generations. Keep it safe for now. It will stay here. To, I'll stay here to investigate the shrine. Meanwhile, you should continue your pilgrimage. There is a village over by the lighthouse. Just follow the kinds to get there. Talk to Diana when you arrive. She will tell you where to go next. One jumping trend. <gasps> Can flap bank left bank right oh okay enter free look camera okay so shift reset chase camera okay oh whoa all right so so there's a lot to take in there um oh birdies buddy bird Oh, buddy bird. Oh, buddy bird bird. Yeah, okay. I'm going to flop in that direction and see what there is. What do we have here? There are some symbols and signs in the environment, but I'm not sure they mean anything. I am Yohal of the Sultan Isles, and this is the first entry in the tale of my people. Our homeland around the city of Urza are shattered. The world broke apart. I think it has to do with the ending of the Great War against On. I have gathered the survivors who have made camp among the islands now floating in the sky. I used broken stones to sail towards the lands of God. How to find answers there? I called for the spirit animals, but can't tell if they have heard me. Before I left, I saw sickness take hold of a tree, covering it in black rock. I must warn the other clans. Okay. Black rock is bad, but metal is good. Let's go and fly and see if I can. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Visually, sound wise, it looks awesome. It sounds awesome. And this is so good. You do have a feeling of freedom, that is excellent. And there's no really crashing. I don't think you have really um, a hull bar. So left and right click do not do anything. So I'm guessing that is going to be an exploration thing. <laughs> okay, that feeling is awesome. Honestly. So I can fall from any height. But the transformation falling down looks awesome. Man. I like the small greeneries. Yo. Hello there. Hello, Oak, and welcome. What was that noise we heard? What? You made it out okay? I'm John, by the way. Dinah and I take care of the lighthouse here on the island. We try to make sure that nothing weird happens in the lands of gods. Not an easy job considering all the strange old ruins and wonders here. I've had, I haven't had much time to visit them since Erin was born, but I don't mind. I think she longs for adventure, which makes a father proud. If you have the time, I would recommend you to go to the Windsong Falls. When the world was whole, a water spirit combed her hair at the stream there. Beautiful hair at that. The wind sang to make her hair flow down until it mixed with the clouds. Thus, the rainbow was born. Not that I've ever seen one there myself, but it's a nice story. Anyway, you can find a place just north of here. Continue beyond the clouds. You know what? I'm supposed to call to talk to that person, but now he, he said north. We're going to go north to that. 
thing beyond the cloud. So I guess those are the clouds that he was talking about. We're going to speed past them. Ah, this is the... Oh, this is so good. Exactly the type of thing that I needed. Oh. Well. Read part three. Uh, uh, you know what? Uh, yeah, wait. Wait, wait. This is part three, so I'm going to do them in order. Part one. My name is Aram, and I was there on the day of the Great Divide. My youngest child was ill, and I asked the spirit animals for help. When I prayed by the shrine of Iloqui, a terrible brightness pierced the air, and the land trembled and screamed. In terror, I took flight and watched with eagle eyes as the land broke into pieces, which crumbled and turned to dust. Only one place seemed calm. I flew there and perched on it. Horror struck. It was the lighthouse. Okay. That's probably two. The lighthouse was surrounded by golden by a golden shimmer that warmed and soothed me. I saw the priestess Kara pass me by, weeping. She held the lantern key, such as they make in the city of Uza, but the lantern was dead. The shimmer came from Kara herself, dwindling as I watched. She descended the lighthouse, and I saw that many spirit animals had gathered around the tower, watching. When Kara came to them, they bowed their heads and then left as if it was an unspoken signal. Alright. And was the pound thing? Kara then looked at me and said, You are Ara? I know you. And we need to talk. Holy shit, she's giving him the talk. I found my voice and asked, What? What has happened to the world, Kara? She was silent for a moment and then said, A great danger has gone. But also a great light. It's time we gather all who are lost so we may find a way for all people to live in peace with the world again. Ever since then, I have been flying from one broken island to another to tell the lost people that there is a new home. To lead them there, here, where we, in time, may heal again. Where my youngest can regain their strength. Well, it's a tale of... ending and beginning, I guess. In the skies. Can I do something with those things? No, they just say hello. And they have different colors. A reddish one. Um, okay, I'm not going to try to name the colors because I can't, um, you know, color blind and all. So, I guess I can go inside the waterfall directly. Let me see if I can do something there. Oh, there is something there. Can I read it? Uh, well, that's not the language that I can read. Let's go down. Oops. <laughs> okay, when she touches surfaces, she doesn't die, she just transforms, uh, which is a good thing. So, said that she went around here in order to calm her air, right? There are a lot of animals around. What did is that one say? Okay, I think it's time to get back to the city, which is behind the clouds over there. Let's go. Let's talk to Diana or whatever. Ooh, wait, there is a tablet there. There's also a fox. Apparently. Is that a fox or is that me? No, it's a claw. No, it's a fox! Is he sleeping or has it been crushed by a stone or is it blocked by a stone? I don't know. 
let's read. In the beginning, there was the dreamer. Asleep in cold eternity, she dreamed all there is. She dreamed a veal, and behind the veal, she dreamed the creator, and the world modeled from a memory of home. The creator danced into the world, and there he bred the clouds and sang the sun and moon into being. As he danced between the clouds, he took four steps, and so made the lands of the north, north, the west, the south, and the east. Then he formed the mountains and filled the seas with water from the clouds. And from earth and water he made animals, so land and sea would be alive. From stardust and eternity he made gods to walk the lands and look after the world. All right, that's something. Let's get back to the city, as I said. Oh, wait, there's a little thing over here. Okay. So basically, those guys are going full crab rave. Cool. And you can't see because I deactivated the overlay, but uh, there was an achievement, like an invited guest. Let's go back to the settlement. Oops. <laughs> I think that's her that I need to talk to. Mm. Are you alright, Oak? It was Oak, right? We had rumblings from Kara's shrine. I'm so glad you made it out. My name is Dinah, and welcome. It was a long time ago we had a pilgrim here. Your mentor, Medvin, was actually the last one before you. My parents helped him back then. Now I, John, and our daughter, Erin, will help you. If you ever feel lost, just return here and talk to us. We're here to guide you, after all. Every pilgrim's journey requires a visit to three temples in the land of God. Kara sealed them a long time ago, right after the Great Divide. There is a sigil in the ground close to each temple. That's where we gather to pay respect to the spirit. And so, you too should go there. Secret words are revealed to those who approach within an op with an open mind. The Eventide Sanctuary... sanctuary the Eventide Sanctuary is closest and you will find it northwest of here. Okay, let's go northwest. Let's talk to Oak! Oak! That's your name, right? Right? What happened? Did you see any ghosts? Or spirit animals? Treasures? Secrets? I want to explore too. It's so unfair that I'm stuck on this island. Sometimes I go on adventure with my parents, but it's still adventures. We once went to a super awesome place, it's up north, and it's kind of snowy, with this huge statue. It's kind of broken, but still cool. And my name is Erin, so you know. Okay, thank you Erin. Oh, well, <laughs> I got an achievement for that. Uh, I didn't mean to jump into the well, but... Oh, can I go into the... into there? Do I have a load screen for this? Yes, I do. Pilgrim study. Interesting. I can't read this, it's written in a language I don't know, and much of it is broken and almost unreadable anyway. Maybe Medvin knows how to decipher it. Okay. Yes, she... I, yeah, I know you can't read this. I know my child. Yeah. Pretty much all of them, okay. Ooh! Fishy, fishy, fish. Man, this is not very deep, and those fishes are having a very bad time. At least if I was a fish around there, I would 
That would not feel good. So I guess we're on the other end. Yeah. So let's see. Oh, I went in a bush. I'm in a bush. So it said northwest, right? Let's go to northwest now. Oops. Oh wait. Can can I just pass? The oh, okay. I can accelerate through those things. That's what those things mean. Ah, interesting. Okay. Cool. Oh, there is light over there. I'm going to check out that afterwards. What is... I discovered the Twilight Lake. Okay. There are some symbols here. I can't do anything with those symbols, by the way. Um, there's some audio cues. Audio jungle. Oh, there was a frog. Um, is there some kind of physics? Meaning that if I go on top of that tree and... Nope, there is nothing. It stays static. Okay, I'm going to go to those birds. I don't know what this means. Oh, there's also something on the wall over there. I'm going to go there also. Okay, that doesn't do anything. And... So there's a mark with a three. That doesn't mean anything to me. At least so far. It's a very exploration driven game, apparently. Which I'm perfectly fine with. It's kind of cool. Oh, I'm going to pass into the hole. Yeah. That's how you do it. So there's a broken bridge below. Huh. Is there anything else close to this? Like, I can see. No, there is not much. Oh, wow. There's that area over there. I'm going to come back to this bridge afterwards. Let's go to that lake over there. That looks like something that we can do. Read. Hope for all people was restored by the wisdom of her words and the refuse she gave us. The spirit animals helped her ride the way in, behind falling waves marked by sun and moon in the close northeast. Okay. So I guess I need to go northeast from here. Let's see. Man, she, she acts like a rocket, literally. And there are those lights over there. I need to check them afterwards. So there's that thing over there. And several lights. Okay. Oh. Oh, and I have a map still. I didn't realize that I had a map. Oh, which I can move. Oh, cool. Okay, that is great, actually. Um. Woo! Well, let's go on top of the tower. Is there anything? Oh, there is something I can read. I'm Raya. Your heart's daughter. I sent all his words to make sense of what happens, what happened to him during his journeys. My father's burden lay heavy on his shoulders. Even though we found a new home, he was never the same again. There is hope, and more children have been born this spring than the last. We will recover. But I think he worried about things yet to come. 
I think the sickness of Black Rocks, my father found scared him more than anything else. It's only been... It's only been seen once or twice again, however. These islands we now know wander us. God, I can't read. This is amazing. These islands we know wander are safe. Kara is soon having a child of her own, and laughter has returned to our hearts. Okay. So, basically, it's rebuild the story of those people. So wind is coming from there. I don't think there is some stuff more there. Oops. I thought I had enough. I'm going to go to the light stuff. I'm guessing that there will be a, like a one, two, three kind of kind of deal. Okay, this looks like an otter. Is that an otter? It looks like an otter, right? Am I supposed to... Windsome Falls. Okay, there is no mouse over, over the one. Okay, so that one doesn't do anything. Let's go to the next one. Uh, because there was one on the right, right? Was I crazy? Kind of so a ray of light. Yeah, that one. That's a second. Wait. So those are two otters. Hmm. I'm utterly confused. Bad puns. <laughs> okay, I can do this. I don't think there was anything there. Didn't look like there was something there. Let's keep on going northeast and see if I discover something. The King's Pass. There is something there. Not all spirits persist forever. Praise to the cinnamon finger, the dancer of the Sultan Threes. Never will, will she play beneath their shade. She fell into the darkness never to laugh again with us. From star to star, she skips, following the gods into eternity. Praise to the dance, ended and begun. Also, sing of the voice of the grassland. Also sing of the voice of the grassland, the sun roarer, the wind caller. Never again will it race through the reeds of the lakes, steering up the swans or hunt the horses of the wild. We now prowls in the dark between dream and awake, sing of his voice unforgotten, till the stars fade into morning light. Ah, neat little stuff. Okay, so there is a mountain over there. So that's the mountain that was mentioned before. There's something over there? Ah. Oh, what are you? Again, there are some symbols there, but I feel like... Ah. I'm missing something. Oh, the, the stuff to read? No. No stuff to read here. Man, the music is perfect. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. in the belly of the beast. Once, when the gods were still awake, some animals gathered to talk. A hare said, the grass is not as green as it was. A bear said, 
the honey does not flow as it used to. A wolf said, there are less deer to hunt. And the deer said, well, I do my best. An eagle said, the lands have become smaller. A crane said, the humans write less and argue more. An owl said, there is a darkness deeper than the night. And it grows. At this, the other animals felt silence and the wind howled around them. Ooh. Oh, there is something there. Can I do something with this? Ding, ding, ding. Am I supposed to remember this? Okay. I discovered the howling peaks. There's just a light over there. Oh! I guess... That's one of the three caverns that I need to find? Probably? Maybe? Eventually? Whoa. <laughs> okay. Well, for a second, I thought that the loading times were a little bit overboard. Beartooth Cave. Wow. Can I transform? No, okay. I cannot transform inside. I can only transform outside. Notes on Legends of the Western Clans by Red, the scholar of the Summer Island. Everything in the land of gods is sacred. Especially, there is a shrine called the Lighthouse, which is remote to be a place of power. Some ancient texts refer to it as the House of the First Light, the cradle of the world, where the ancient gods first woke up and walked the lands. No, it just looms as a small black tower made from alien obsidian, lonely and abandoned, a relic in the eyes of our civilization. Is it a mistake that we don't care for what was left of us, what was left to us by an ancestor? Z maybe, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. I mean, sometimes you need to care, but not all that you inherit is by Bison's good. Oh yes, I could use the lantern, which is F, by the way. I completely forgot about that. Oh, what's that? Oh, hello. Milady, welcome. <laughs> it's an honor to receive you here. You may not know me, but I know who you are. Come, listen to my story. I still remember the time when Caro was still a cub. It was her first visit to the land of gods. Her clan was traveling through. I myself was still young, just over a hundred years. What? And as a chance would have it, they stopped for a rest near my home at the time. I was walking by and she went up to me. She was still without words, but she hugged me, and her heart talked to me. Years later, she came back. She remembered me. One of her first memories, she said. I offered her a pact, but she had already entered one with the bird of the Thunder Isles. We became good friends, however, and I was the first to meet her after the Great Divine. So you tell me that the bear wanted to get down with Kara? The creator had split himself to lock away a void growing in his heart. The world crumbled. He had given Kara the task of keeping the pieces of his being safe. Three fragments of great power, the void locked in his prison, and one last piece, 
his hopes, his dreams, and his love for the world and its beauty. Kara came to me much later again, when the world was calm once more, to present the last piece to me. The cup was as small as Kara when we met the first time, and her name was Mina. Cool story, bro. Um, do you say something? Ah, time flows so fast, my lady. I thank you for coming here. It was a great pleasure to relieve the past for a short while, but the world is growing weary and is missing something once it had. Now for a great ending of this tale, and it seems it's not entirely over just yet. Okay, bear. The fuck am I supposed to do now? Can I ride the bear? No, I can't ride the bear. Well... Uh, thank you, Mr. Bear. I think I can get out? I talk to a bear. Chill. That... that what? That's not this direction. Ah, it's left. Okay, it's left. Or was it that direction? Ah, it looked like it was back, right? Okay, I can get out here. That makes sense. I was for a second confused. Okay, I saved, so probably I progressed now, I'm guessing. So let's go, let's go north over there. Man, I just feel cold looking at this. I need to check below if there is something. I don't think there was. Nope, there wasn't. A lot of currents. Wind is blowing into the darkness as I'm floating in the air. Light as a feather. Alert as a fox. Oops. There is a there is a bell over there. <laughs> God damn it. There is something here. There is a symbol there. So I'm guessing that there is still something I need to discover and then get all those symbols. I don't know what the birds do also. I mean, there are a lot of things that I don't know. Oh, 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 what? Nope. <laughs> Please get back. God damn it. to go there are several signs of, I'm I'm guessing that there must be something about oh shit okay I need the torch for that it took me way too long I realize you've traveled far but there is no path up there anymore the ground has fallen to the depth those of us still here are leaving in a fortnight oops okay so I probably missed a little bit of the story. Um, man, it took me too long to understand this. Oh, shoot. And I'm guessing that's what happens with all those things, right? Oh, well, I can read this, but... A place of sacred solitude and peace from the buzzing of the world. After it stood clear that the world needed healing, the bear froze, the doors shut and throws the key at another place. The cave of harmony, of bells and ice. East of here, among the mountains of the Holing Peaks. 
So I have not been yet to the east. And I have not explored all that area either. Okay, cool. Let's, let's go up that peak for a second. Let's see if there's something interesting. Wow. That's a big fortress. What well, looks like a fortress to me. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There is something in the ice here. That's like a sheep, a giant sheep. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, I don't think there is more. So we're going to go east from here. I totally forgot about the lamp. The lamp was probably the, the thing that was missing. Oh, there are guys over there? Or was that the people that I... Okay, living in a fortnight, that's... The people that I... So before. So now I'm going to return to most of the areas where I thought that, you know, I had nothing and use the lamp and see if it does anything. That doesn't do anything. There were some symbols at some places. So. I think there was a symbol where I was there, right? Okay, that didn't do anything. I like the tingling of that thing. It's very relaxing. Holding peaks. This is where we needed to go, right? This is great. Oh, light. video game logic when there is light this is where you need to go oops <laughs> note some legend of the western clans by red the scholar of summer island there are numerous legends about the gods of the old clans one such legend told by some clans in the far northwest say that there is not one creator but two one who made the realm which they called the Great Dream, and one who made the world and its inhabitants. They also speak of the Soul Pact, an ancient bond between us and this creator of world. Fascinating. But hard to believe. I agree, this is hard to believe. Oh, there's stuff over there. That's... I don't... Just don't look down and we'll be fine. I wish I could just fly over these damn cliffs. Yep, that's something I can do. Uh, there is also something down, right? I need to be... Smart. Okay, there's something here. Perfect small loading screen, which takes ages for some reason. Wow, I like a idle animation when she does that small twirl.
the Cave of Harmony. That guy looks like, oh fuck, and that bear is just like not giving shit. Ah, that is a bell. Okay, one. Oh, the, the screen shaking is not going to be annoying at all. Okay, one. Can I transform? No. That is going to be a two. A three and a four. I love the animation. Appeared out of nowhere. And I always love the kind of um, symphonic, you know, chords like maintain that is a very lyric in a, in a sense. I don't know if it makes sense, but take the key. Yes, please, give me the key. got the key there doesn't seem to be much more in this I really like games like these and also the the stillness of the wind oh that's the fox that we saw earlier the two-tailed fox you want to say something now? No. Is he going to speak to us? Hello there, Fox. My friend, the little wanderer, on the way to the far north. Aren't you cold? Even I can feel the chill through my fur. Might be the hot bloodedness of humans. Well, at least you made the air shimmer in here. Like the stars found at the roof of the world. Where the air is crisp and clear, and storms never rage. A key in the eyes to break ice once more. Go west, go north, but don't freeze to death as other creatures before you. Well, all right, fox. You. Well, or that fox is swole. That 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 fox goes to to exercise. Kind of cool though. Yes, let's see. So it was go west, go north, right? So I guess he wants us to go over here. Um, you know what? I'm going to go east from here for a little while and see if I can discover something new. Feels like the map itself. Well, there are currents that go to the east, so we're going to do that. Okay, so we get back to the birds if we go too far from something. Okay, cool. That's what it means. All right. Northwest, here we come. Perfect stuff. Ru 
proof of the world. Did we discover? Yes, we did. Oh, but now the key can open this. That's probably why we can see it. Oh, wow. All right, all right. Oh, and there is something below that I didn't see originally. Okay. But Kara insisted. And he led her into the animal sanctuary. She stayed there for three days and three nights. No one knows what she did in there. She left, her she left us without a word. But her face was sad and a fear for all people. What can we do but guard the most holy text of our ancestors? Well, but few, and no one believes us. A whole world has gone mad, and there is no cure. Fuck, that was part two. I'm Zuya of the snow. Today, a priestess from the far south, south east came to us, telling us of a great war between the city of Uza and Old. Uh, I'm just going to take down a notch after with uh, the sound of the game. Ah, uh, yep. Host? No. Her name was Kara, and she requested an audience with the god and said to sleep here, the Watcher of the Veil. Our master of the scrolls bowed to her and told her if there was ever was a god, he must be sleeping so deeply that even he could not awaken. Setting audio. Let's. Go a master of ten. That is good. This seems like a good sound level. Yeah, exactly. Otherwise it was a, a little bit too much. Just a tiny itsy bitsy too much. Let's get back up. Oops. Great. I would like to open the temple, please. And there the temple was open. The way was clear. And I could see the light. Man, it has that game a lot of relaxing qualities. Music is chill. Art style is chill. Story is chill. Everything is chill. Ooh. Should I go upstairs first? Okay, I'm going to just go straight to see what what gives. Ah. Okay, I prefer to go upstairs. We'll see what gives. Oh, shiny stuff. It's too dark to see anything. Uh, even with light, that doesn't work. Okay. I'm going to guess that we need to find the seals in order to open the door. And that would be each of the different temples right use okay ah now those things are open okay oh i'm an idiot so this one i got oh wait what there's so many stuff Hmm. So now, can you see something? In the beginning, there was the dreamer, a sleeping cold eternity. She dreamed all there is. She dreamed a veil, and behind the veil, she dreamed the creator. The creator, bone, the same. Okay. Okay, we already read that, but basically, dreamer gives creator, creator gives everything else. Everybody is happy.
Hmm. Puzzle time? I'm going to guess. I guess we need to have the right order, right? Oh. So this is red, okay. So she's happy with this. She's apparently happy with this. That that not. Okay. So bam. Bam. So now I'm going to check on the other side. I'm wondering if it's a trial and error thing or red, okay. Well, I can rejump from this side. Do this, do that. Do that. That is not how she wanted it. Okay. So bam. 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 She doesn't like this. Okay. This one. That one. And I get back to the center. Uh, if I go far right, which is usually politically not the right thing to do. What does she say? Red. Okay. I will explore. Maybe there is some clue somewhere. Hmm. That's a bit creepy. Can I jump on this? Okay, I can't really jump on this. Okay, I can jump on that. Can you come over here? Okay. What does that guy say? That guy is praying. Can I pray? I can't. Oh, there's something else over there. Okay. All right, I opened the door. This has very much a Zelda vibe to it. There was a shimmering on that wall, I think. If I'm not mistaken. Maybe I was. I can jump. I can jump. I can jump. Oh. What? Okay. So that one is left, left, okay. If I do this, that one is okay. That one doesn't show anything, right? So I have this. But I couldn't jump this one, right? Oh yes, it does. That one doesn't do anything. It tells me center on the other side. Center on the other side? Is that really that simple? Okay, that was really that simple. And now if I do this... That... Oh, 
Okay. So I probably missed it the first time. Well, that was easy. Let's go do this one first. Can I go to the big door? Oh, there is a big, big ball. Okay. Can't do something directly on the big door. And I'm guessing that there is something down there. But I need to open the door. Which I guess needs to be done through a puzzle here. Oh, is that going to be a perspective thing? Oh, I need to... Oh. Okay. What? So I'm guessing I need this. Power down. Okay. Power up. I guess I need to have the bird. Perfect. That seems to be the... Oh. But there are other symbols there, right? So can I do something else with it? What are those guys doing? So it's down to the two of us now. Well, well that has gone dark very fast. I was hoping that there might be some praying to do here or something. But apparently there isn't. So I can go back now, I guess. To that door over there. Because there's no other door here, right? No. There's nothing. Just the door over there. Let's see. Okay, that opens on approach. That's a good thing. Let's activate this. Oh, okay. So now I can get back to... To the beginning, I guess. Because this is the main chamber. Why well, open the main door? Which is underneath there. But there is the stuff on top. And I can get the, the stairs in order to get back up. Well, I'm just going to check here very quickly. Okay, not going to go too far. The entrance gate is frozen shut. There is no leaving now. Oof. I mean, the undertone has, are kind of super dark. Basically, those guys are trapped. And apparently going to die. Man. It was a happy moment. Okay, so there's a statue over there. Oh, there is somebody over there. Alright, I will jump down afterwards. And access that small area. Um, do you have something for me? Okay, that door is closed. Can I jump over this? I apparently can't, but I can fall down here. Help someone! I think the door locked itself. Oh, this, this tells a very frightening stories of people getting stuck in this temple and trying to escape it. Design is cool though. Hmm, okay. Is 
this thing is okay I can shoot stuff through is there anything on the sides uh, not that I can see just frozen wasteland okay. so I can activate things further Okay, now it's just a jumping puzzle, so that's kind of all right. There's also that extra stair on the left, right, which I can't really access. Let's see. Can access this. Okay, so there's extra stuff go under the stair to jump on the stairs. That's about right. And activate this. That's the the thing I could see from the other side, right? Okay. Okay. Now I backtrack and go where I was. And I'm guessing... Oh, no. I was going to say there's probably something that is going to shoot back there. Ooh. Cool stuff. Sort of a quick travel mechanic. Hmm. Let's back let's get back up over there. Um no. It's up here, right? It's past the bridge. Past the bridge and up the stairs. Because we need to go all the way up. Yes, Morty. All the way up. Nice. They just, whomever did the art direction in this did a perfect job. This looks absolutely amazing. I'm confused with the sound effect though. Because this makes the sound of a fireball. Sort of. Well, you could have a plasma ball, right? Ooh. The big ball is now activated. Nice. And I made a fast access where you can just jump down. Ooh. Well, I can't pass through the holes there. Oh, yes. An Aurora Boil. Oh, a giant whale! Cool. Come closer, little champion. I won't ruffle your feathers. I'm the Watcher of the Veil. I guard this world from eternity. But I have spent many years trying to close the rift that threatened this world. Now, without the fate of your kind, my powers are almost gone. There isn't much left of the first dream. Of the great dreamer, sorry. The dream we can we call our home. Did you know that the first dream brought forth the creator? Well, that has been said several times. His only weakness was a tender spot for your kind, little human. To create you, he linked his heart to yours, but your hearts grew empty. Shocked by the emptiness dwelling in himself, the creator rippled the void out of his heart. But the time changes many things, and a new little champion stands before me. A human one, even. Listen now, champion. There are, there are my last words. You have to oppose you have to oppose the void. That has come to our world once again. But Okay, I need to read that a little bit better. But as you are now, you will surely lose. The priestess carried it three fragments of hid three fragments of great power, one in each temple. You have to make the three fragments whole again. When I'm gone, know that the days of your world are numbered. 
as there will be no one left to guard the veil between the realms anymore. Here, take my fragment. It all rests upon your shoulder now, little champion. What? That went from very relaxing, chill game to it's going, the world is going to end Zelda type business. And three fragments, so the Triforce, I guess. No, I'm barking the darkness. Tell me it's a giant robot. I want this to be a giant robot, like Zone of Ender style. Um, can I walk into that? Mausoleum of Ice. I think that was seen, at least for this one. Okay, now I got a key. I'm on the roof of the world. I guess I can get back south, south and southeast especially. So I opened that thing, so I'm going to assume that right now this is done. I've seen those guys already. I'm guessing that the symbols are going to become important, but at some other point. I can pass the holding peaks. Oh, there's something there. There are two guys here. Oops. Let me go to them. Even if the temperature has dropped, the springs are still as warm as ever. Ooh. That explains why it's not frozen. It looks like there is something on a small island. Oh yes. yes. If you ever go further north, listen for these bills. They will help you find your way through. Okay, that's probably what I should have known before. Um, but I liked it anyway. Okay, I think we're back now into the realm of hotness. necessarily hotness hotness but you know okay so what do these guys say it's time to face the facts the god king is here to stay it's better to bend a knee than to lose a head I like how that one is just like talk to the hand So that is a respawn point. There's a small island there, apparently. Oh, there's also that giant thing over there. Let's go check this out. Oh, that looks like a whole ship to an extent. The creator's shrine. Okay. Oops. Interesting. I'm guessing the door is not going to open yet. Hello. No. I think I need a little bit more of keys in order to open this one. Um, I'm going to go south now. Uh, because I've not really explored the south. Neither the west, actually, to be honest. What is this? 
Lifa's groove. Uh huh. Have I discovered it? Or... Oh, there are llamas. Uh, also, loved and lost in long cities of cities bright and dead. The white sun of marble raising a long neck elegantly into the purple sky. Eyes of a thousand souls swimming um, the lake of the never ending afternoon in their heart of spring. A song, a million hearts praising the beauty of life undiminished. In brief, a petal on the wind of fall. The white sun of marble folding a luminous wing silently in the ashen of dusk, never to be seen again. Oh. Interesting. Are those... No. Those are not, right? Those are something else than llamas. But they look like llamas seen from afar. I wouldn't mind a llama. Llamas are cool. Okay, they are those things, but it looks like I should fly through them. That's that's how it feels like. Okay, let's go east here. I've not discovered the, this part, I think. The ruins, ruins of On. Not too... Oh, that is broken, okay. There's nothing more we can do. The machine is an, an accident waiting to happen. We got too greedy. Ah. <laughs> okay, that guy is face planting. Uh, either that or they are dead. Okay, that thing exploded. That's what we're... Man, this is dark. This game has very dark undertone. Oh, there is something over there. I don't remember this place being here. Yeah. Are the lands drifting in the wind? We need to hurry if we want to reach some place safe. That's... Oh! Oh, 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 there are some... There are some foxes. Oops! Hello, foxes. Can I talk to you? You're not the super swole one. Oh, you make really adorable noises. <laughs> okay, let's go directly to the city. There must be something along the tower, I'm guessing. Oh, there is a lot of lights. Oh, they are. Just like a broken bird of... Ooh, battle! A giant old, apparently. Oh yeah, that battle was raging on. That is not good. Mayor, open the door. Are you just going to let these soldiers overrun your city? Stop cowering and come out. Man. There's some heavy business in there. I'm going to guess that we can go and see the mayor. No, we can't even. Maybe the mayor is on top? No, probably not. Man, that's an uncool mayor. If you're a leader, you're supposed to help people through, not not let them rot.
There is something with the island there. Okay, there is something else there. Oh. There is a hole here. I'm going to go there. Oh. That guy is reading. So this is part three. Man, this is these are big rolls. Big rolls. Part one. Okay. To Goreon are the storm islands from his son Tozu. Father. It's with sorrow that I must tell you of the loss of the Snow Crane Library. The palace guard of the city of On came in the night carrying weapons and shouting the name of the king, Koroku. Hmm. They destroyed and burned houses and scrolls alike, and would have burned us too, had we not been able to escape. We watched from a safe distance, keeping close the few precious scrolls we had saved. The oh, man. This rain knowledge is a terrible thing. We will journey to the monastery in the northwest to place the scrolls in in its safety. I trust that it's too far away for Koroku's wrath and too poor to excite his greed. The spirit crane will lead us until the snow line and then return home south with my letter to you. I hope he finds you well. So he said north Northwest, okay. Monastery in the northwest. This is northwest. Oh, so there's probably something there, right? That's that's what he tells me. He went to the northwest. Okay. Let's go then. I'm I'm just going to explore a little bit more of the city to see if there's something interesting. Wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, we is. There are a lot of people here. What are those guys saying? The God, God King demands changes. By royal decree of God King Koroku, kings of kings and gods of gods, all must bow to him, the only God. His, his and his alone are all the lands of the East and the lands of the gods. Bend the knee and be spared. Resist and see the last of your days. Such is the will of the God King Koroku, now and forever, written in the tenth year of the Aaron in his great city of On. That guy... That guy meant business. So, he said Northwest, right? Well, I'm going to go in this direction and see what happens. There are two guys here. Oops. Thank you. I'm going to see what they see. Sir, our scouts report that several deposits of air have been found under the temple grounds north of here. Alright. Let's go see some air. <laughs> Eastern steps. Ooh, there's somebody here. Oh, there are rabbits. The guard towers have fallen. Help me search for survivors. Those guys are... Okay, they are moving boulders. Wow. Okay, so that tower was there. Ah, I'm guessing that that is the monastery that it was talking about. Wow. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, wheels! That is a big... That is a big structure. Can I do something here? Oops. I can obviously read it, though. We're going to do that. What does it do? Let me... Let go of me. These are the holy grounds, not just another power source for the taking. Well... Let's read this. Inside lies holes of knowledge and safekeeping, scrolls on the walls and shafts stretching down into the deep. It was a place of great power, together with Lifta of the Great Tree in the west. 
Karasil did in Wait for the Right Time. Well, time has come. That's my take, at least. Okay, let's go and see over there. Oh, there is a tablet here. Home of thousands, we build this shrine to stand beacon and as home to the birds of these lands, much as birds did for us in the ancient days. They've been our friends since forever. They scouted the lands and settled in places of soil which could sustain us. When we still were the tribes in the wild, we traveled with the birds as they moved. We trusted them to mark the moment of change. They taught us to be nomads and shaped us to what we became. Hmm. Okay, birds are cool. Kind of makes sense. I love the design of the bird. I don't like the, the shakiness of the movement, but they found us quick mirror run. Man, I, I kind of like that, you know, detective type of saying, but it tells terrible stories with <laughs> a, a very happy undertone. Like, the music is chill, everything is chill. But when you hear what happens, it sounds terrible. Mm, is there something here? It looks like something interesting, right? There are people here. Pack your things, sisters. The rumors are true. We are leaving for the west. This priestess will give us shelter. Well, at least those people apparently escaped. Oh, there's plenty of more stuff here. Ooh. Let's go and land here. Yeah. This is the protector that my father and his father before him asked guidance of. That was before the God King protected us. Well, did the God King protect you, really? Was this protection that he offered? And not servitude? Let's see. Split Mountain. I also found an achievement which is called Cartographer, so I'm guessing that it means that I found most of the stuff on the map. Okay. One, I guess. Read part one. I am Ura, and a guardian of the land of gods. I made this record so that my children and children's children may remember. On the day of the Great Divide, when our world shattered, I was still a child. I remember sitting at the wide stairs of the southern city of Uza. We had planned to journey to the west, but since the God King has waged war on our city, our lands were not safe anymore, and we stayed inside the city walls. The God King, Koroku, we had called, had built horrible weapons, flying machines of raining fire, but we always thought them far away or even empty rumors. Well, something tells me that it wasn't. When the bell started ringing, fires and tears mixed in a horrible rain over us. We wept and screamed to the gods to end this, but they were answered by silence. Then the ground trembled, great cracks appeared and split the white stone walls of Oza, and people fell into the black depth of the earth. I saw my loved one disappear into the heaving earth, and when the steps beneath me broke, I fell too. But my spirit animal spoke to me, and I remembered and spread my wings. I do not know how, but I flew for a long time over broken lands and stormy clouds. I arrived at the outskirts of the land of gods, half dead, and fell unconscious on its grass. When I walked there, a priestess sat beside me, tending my wounds. She said that Uza was not no more and that the world had shattered. A god had sacrificed himself to seal away a void from our hearts. 
and broken the world in the process. Many had died, but so had the God King, and his city of On was no more. The shattered world was now at peace. I wept, and still, after many years, I weep at the memory of this day and the terrible cost of this peace. I'm kind of glad that the atmosphere, the rest of the atmosphere of the game is very light, I would say. Okay, there is something here. Let's go. Let's see what this cave has in store for us. I hope good stuff. Hmm. Equals then. Let's see. You're pointing in that direction. Thank you, sir. I'm guessing it's going to be a jump puzzle to go on top, right? That's seems reasonable. those light mushrooms the whole atmosphere is so relaxing can I jump make that jump I'm not sure that I can make that jump oh well my foxy friend is back hello there hello again my wandering friend what kind of you to visit an old fox den it's quite empty, don't you think? No, not the den, the land of the gods. Not as many animals anymore, nor as many spirit. Lifla is still in her cave, it seems, and the old spirit bear moves from cave to cave in the north. But there were more once. See, a fish, a crane. The spirit shift, the spirit fish lived in rivers and pools around the twilight lake. His last gift to us is the water that never stopped flowing. Without it, we would have been lost a long time ago. And the spirit crane, she helped guide the last priestess and priest and priestess north during the Great Divine. She was hunted down by Korokus men, as they mistook her for her son, fools. As they declined, so are we declining. All we can do now is ask questions, and I have two for you. Why the Great Divide? And why you? Wanderer, wander in search of answers, little wanderer. Thank you for your company. It was such a long time ago. But finish your quest now, or else there won't be another time. Um, cool, cool story, bro. Um, so you tell me that basically I shouldn't have come here. That's my take on it. Oh, I should have jumped. Okay. So I'm guessing there is not much else to do here. Because I can't really get over there. I'm, I'm just going to do a, a last round to see if there is something that I have not explored or something that I've missed. Feels like there must be something up there. Okay, that's the, the, the statue itself. We're well, going to get back to exploration. Back to relaxation. While well, civilization fall apart. So, now, I have most of the map. I'm guessing. So the split mountain is there. I'm wondering if I click. So I have one part and one key. Okay. What else? What is, is there to find? Well, there's that giant stuff over there. Okay, I read those things. There's that peak still over there. We're going to go. Ooh, 
There are plenty of people there. Fighting, I guess. Arg. Surrender, you dogs of own. Yeah, so there was a battle here. Man, I... I like very much the design of the... Of the monsters slash battle things, right? The, the combat all is very cool. Reminds me of um, Bioshock Infinite a bit. I don't know if this game came before or after Bioshock Infinite. I should check. I know this game has been around for a little while now. I had my eyes on it because the, the art style is very... That's the kind of style that I'm, is very close to my heart. Very minimalistic, very simple. But we are lost in different worlds. I without you and you without anyone. In my mind, we reach out to each other and hold hands in the cloud, in the cold. But as the statues are chained, but as the statues are chained to the world, so are all souls to life and death. Sarida, I don't know where you are, but your memory will forever roam the halls of my heart. That's super poetic. That's kind of nice. I'm pretty sure that that tree is not supposed to be there. Um, but it's fine. So... Northwest would be the, the frozen wasteland. But it was saying that they might be like a library of some kind. So this is the Holding Peaks, right? So what is happening here? Is that the bear cave where I was right before? Maybe. Because the bear cave was on the other side, I think. On the west. I discovered a tear. Oh. So this is where things are going... ...bad. Oh yes, okay. Alright, those guys are having a bad time. Can I read this? My love gazes at the false sky, but she will not know me. I took her hand and said her name, but her mind was empty. I fear that it's the doing of Hungry Star. I was stolen her souls. The followers say it's a new god, and she's part of it now. The priestess of the old god said that her soul is lost forever. But do I want to believe this? She will try to close the rift. As open... As... No. Take two. She will try to close the rift. It has opened to our world. But all those who wander on the other side will never come back. Her name was Sarida. Okay, so that was the first one. And the tear is this thing. Okay. Can I even jump into the tear? No, I don't think I can. I'm guessing that I need to come back here once I've got... I've collected everything. So I need to come back south, right? I probably need to go south from everything. Let me let me try to go as south as I can. On the split mountain. And I I like the design of this bird a lot. It 
So we had the big structure to the to the east over here. Eastern steps. So that giant structure here. Which okay, I didn't check underneath if there was um An access of some kind. No, there isn't. Wow. Okay, I made it. I already thought I was going to crash on this one. Um, oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hello there. There's something there. God has told me that the mountains to the north were falling apart shouldn't believe such rumors, Dalius. That was the original map, I think, of the area. Or at least how, how they envisioned it. Hmm. Okay, so there is no access to anything underneath here. <laughs> that is just a hole. Oops. There was guys over there. Is this not the city of love? Well, back to the ruins, ruins of own, which I'm not that interested in, um, to be honest. So I was more interested at trying to go to the south or past. Maybe the east, see if there is something beyond the clouds over there. And then a little bit south. No. Okay, I can't go past there. That is good. That is good to know. Um, now we're going to go west and see if there is something more that I had learned. So I'm practically looking now for... Um, how you call that? A cave of some kind. Oh, I can directly go back to the guide. Because I guess that's that's how the game is supposed to go. Leafus Grove. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, so there are those guys over here. What do they say? No, why are you doing this? The old gods are dead. This power belongs to the god king Koroku now. Holy fuck. Well... There is a lot of death in their wake. Um, we can fly over there, but that wouldn't bring anything. Oh, there is something there. There is something there. Yes. Okay, cool. Oh, there is a door. Okay, I needed the light in order to be able to activate it. Okay. Is that something that is going to be on a timer? Okay, the door is over there. But do I need to fly through those doors in a sequence? This is going to be my question. I'm not sure, I'm pretty sure not, but uh, we're going to try. Ooh. One. Two. And the last one is over there. Will that open the door? I hope so. Perfect score. Okay. Yep, that opens the door. Okay. So one more temple. 
one more puzzle. And then there will be only one left, right? I think that will be overall like a four hour kind of thing. I think so. Maybe, eventually. Deep and nice. The heartwood. Nice stuff. There is something there. What is this? That's a deer. Is that you, Kara? No, can't be right. Who are you? I need to get out. I am weak. It's a rock. It's not of this world. The rift further down in the cavern. Close it. Okay. Ooh, and there's a button. Oh, now, now we're talking. Now it's much more puzzle. Puzzle platforming. Oh, oh, don't, don't go now. Don't go. Yes. Great stuff. I guess I need to jump on the other side. Bring on to, to the other side. Bring them to, to the other side. Yep. Okay, that is coming over there. Yep. And then... Can I just jump in the middle or is that the big rock i think the big rock is what i'm looking for yeah because the big rock is much more close to the center okay i'm closing the rift Okay, so now... Oh yes, parkour. Excellent stuff. So let's speak to the deer. Oh, is that a deer? I don't even know what that is, but it looks like it. You, you did it. I feel much better already. Thank you. I was beginning to fear a fate where I would fade away. Koroku's men took hold of my home. They wanted the magic of this place. I fought for so long, but I'm just one and there were so many. At least I kept the most important secret. And it's the one you are looking for too, isn't it? I have what you need. Here, take the key. It was my task to protect it. And so I have. Thanks again, young one. I'll leave the rest to you now. Ooh. And I talk to all the spirit animals. Thanks. Oh. The swell guy is back. Ah, oh, my friend. What leads a bird to the east and to visit Lifla on top of that? Oh, so she held the key all this time. Use it where it belongs, further east and a dash north. Close to my home to be through. But answer me this. How come temples lead downwards? When people look up to the skies, for answer. It has eluded me for centuries. 
But that's fine. Humans are special creatures, to say the least. All right, dude. You're having a good one. Great. Okay, so... He said to the east and a dash north, right? To the east and a dash north. So I'm I'm guessing that's that thing. I'm going to go there. Okay, I see the light. The light is over there. That makes perfect sense. Eastern steps. Nice. Opening the temple is a good thing. animation i i like the design of the whole thing i always kind of like those mechanical things in general let's enter the temple the western monument coming along huh. well let's go to west okay people coming off there fire and Hmm. Okay. I think I can come down here. Oh, I like the sword. This has definitely Zelda vibes. And it's a good thing. Okay, what are those guys saying? The dreams of the people are calm again. I hope this full ordeal with the king is nothing more than an old man worrying about nothing. Well, we shall see, shall we? Okay, I can't activate this yet. There is no scroll here. Oh, but there is something downstairs there. Okay. Oh, wait. Ah, oh, I guess that's the ordeal with the king. Okay, I went left in, instead of going there. That makes perfect sense. That makes perfect, perfect sense. We found a fortune. There are multiple pockets of air below. Loads more that we had anticipated. The elevator isn't working again. Who keeps turning off the main switch? Well, let's turn on the main switch. Uh, 
Hmm. Okay, is that thing opening now? Oh, there's something over there. Okay. One second. I just need to do something very quick. Perfect. Hey, Vasinko, doing quite well actually. Um, relaxing in this small game, which is a little bit of a Zelda, Zelda clone, but without being a Zelda clone. Um, overall, it's very nice. I like the art style a lot. Um, the music is excellent. And overall, the Sunday, well, no, Saturday. Well, still Saturday, right? Tell me that was Saturday, and I'm just being stupid now. Yes, Saturday is going well. How is it going for you? How are you doing? Mm, can I jump on this? No, I can't. Yep. I can move a little bit more along there. Okay, so I have one, one lock. I guess I need to get back up. Man, being lazy is a good thing. Relax, enjoy, take uh, your favorite beverage, a cup of tea, a cup of coffee, maybe a cold beverage, a juice of some kind, and enjoy the relaxing vibes of this game. The only thing that I find not relaxing is a bit the... Um, the staggering animation sometimes it just jumps around a little bit more than i wish but you know overall it's kind of kind of good okay I can go in that direction i like the puzzles a lot um, they're not too complicated but no power up Oh, that's what that is going to be one of those puzzles, is it? Yeah, okay. So you're supposed to do this, and then you're supposed to do that. And then you're supposed to do this, right? Excellent. Okay. So there's a blue light below usually indicates that there's something interesting. Feast in honor of the only god, Koroku. Forever is his reign. Kings of kings, and soon the ruler of the known world. Well, that is, that is a program in itself. Not sure I totally agree with that assessment, but... Uh, you keep doing you, you king, mad king god. There's some writing on the wall. Can I read those things? I was wondering because they are sometimes lit up a little bit differently. Let's go down here. Okay, so there is something there. Can I just... Oh! I can jump on the tube. Okay. I'm guessing. Yes, I guessed right. Can I jump behind this? No. There's nothing. But I can activate this now. Wunderbar. Okay, two out of three. Where is the last one? Probably a little bit more up. 
beheaded stage statue. Hmm. Okay, so now where is the last one? Because there was one in the middle, I think. If I remember correctly. Like, oh, wait. Oh, God, no. Mistake, mistakes were made. Wait. Can I or should I? Because there's that thing which is not activated there. I think I missed a door somewhere. So let's let's get back. It's good worth visiting anyway. Okay, so this is where I activated the thing and then I got back. So got back to the main shaft. In the main shaft. So something is making noise now. I'm expecting that that drill at some point will fall down and I will have access to the upper levels. Oh, there. Yes, okay. Perfect. Well, um, the next button was much closer than I expected. Oh, there's one on the right. Alright, in order to make the jumping puzzle, I guess, a little bit more challenging. So this is to come back to the beginning. Man, I love those type of sphinx things. Yes, please. No, it was broken. Okay. <laughs> I jumped right in between the two. I was just like perfectly timed. Let's be a little bit less stressed making those jumps. Get it a little bit better. That one is correct, that one is correct, that one is correct. Okay, this is coming along. What? Okay, so the... It's very hard to explain when you're not playing it. Um, but somehow your hitbox is a little bit weird. So sometimes when you jump or you, you actually hit several um, things in the environment, um, it's not behaving as intuitively if you would think it would um okay but that works we're going to get the next one absolutely perfect i'm guessing i can jump from here oh no from the other side okay Much more obvious than I thought. Okay. And I can jump here. Jump there. Absolutely perfect. Peachy. Absolutely peachy. Oh, and there are three guys in the corner. I will see what they, what they have to say. And now I open the cellar. The king's men are soon here. We will need to hurry. I hope the skulls will be safe here. Okay. Indeed, that that was the safe. Can I read the scroll here? Yes, I can. When the creator made the humans, the Keeper of Dreams came forward and stood guard. 
He saw the link between the great dreamer and eternity. Sometimes fear and nightmares were born into the world, and when snatched up by human thoughts, they turned into horrible realities. So he prepared powerful songs of time and peace, stories to lead the nightmare astray, and he trapped them in eternal scrolls and stole them away. Horrible stories never come true, never to come true, sorry, stored and forgotten in his halls of deep, of sleep. I like the halls of deep, but helmet kind of cool. Wrong, but cool. We found a fortune, yeah, so, so that's uh, what they were saying, that they were extracting the air. I guess I can open this now. Oh, okay, elevator. Oh, I don't need this elevator, I think. Well, okay, I'm good. just going to check the door downstairs to be sure that I don't... Because I'm pretty sure now I can open the door here. So I can use the elevator in order to get back up. I think that that was a, a thing. Nice. Or should I say nice? So the time has come, finally. Then this marks the time for the Keeper of Dreams to wake from this daydream and to resign. How could I protect your people from the nightmare that lurk within their dreams as you cease to believe in me? I doubt you will be able to overcome the shadow that lurks in your world, little human. There is a shadow in every human as well. A shadow called emptiness that can be... This is okay. This is so cool. The wavy effect behind it. I love the design. A shadow called emptiness that can't be filled with power nor possession. Shallow man led way for the void to come into existence, eating everything away. The creator had to sacrifice himself to lock away the ravenous void, and the lands and skies were shattered in the great divide. Heed my word, little human. Will you be able to find the last fragment before the void does? For myself, I claim the deep sleep and leave my concerns to you. I am free. This looks so cool. So that guy is lurking closer to me. I still don't know what it is. As I said, I really hope it's a giant, giant robot. Let's see. So now, where should I go? I'm going to get back to the um, guides at the beginning. So when you, you first begin the game, actually it's exactly like this. You, you're just thrown into the world and then they tell you uh, good luck. Um, but the, the first character that you encounter tell you, well, we are your guide and just like come ask us questions if there is, if you need to know where to go. So I'm going to ask them because now I got two pieces out of three and two keys out of three. Uh, once I got all the pieces, I need to go to that tower, which is the, the, 
the land of the dreamer or whatever. It's so already opened a tree here. That's where I freed the deer. Well, Liflas. Or the doe, but does doe have horns? I don't know. I'm I'm not well educated in the ways of the animals. I'm educated in the ways of cooking animals, but not in the <laughs> in all the ways of them. The settlement, yes. So this is where they are. Okay, where the fire is. Oh, I didn't see the kite. The kite looks so cool. Okay. Hey. We've been taking some care of the land of gods for many years now, me and John, and my parents before us. But I haven't reflected on the rituals of the pilgrimage very much. Why is that you only that only bird shifter go through the pilgrimage? There are other shifters who are chosen by other spirit animals. There are of course the stories that tell of Kara. She was a bird shifter too, but it feels as if it's more than that. As with Kara's light, I feel you were given oh. as with Kara's light, I feel that you were given it to shed light on something important. But you still have part of the pilgrimage left, don't you? Let's see. The Eventide Sanctuary is the closest and is found northwest from of here. Okay. Northwest we're going. Here we go. Alright, so people can Ooh Examine. It doesn't seem to Okay. So once I have the three ones the three keys I can light up the lighthouse. Uh we said northwest, right? We're going northwest. So I guess it's over there or there. Oops. I can keep on flying. Oh man, thank I, I need to always to thank the developers that do those type of games which are so relaxing. You know, we have so many games that are also well, they are nice because they, they can be good outlet, but not as relaxing, potentially. Okay, there is light over here. Can I do something here? Oops! Uh, I don't know if I was supposed to bounce, to bounce, bounce this way. Um, I'm going to guess no. Okay. I'm trying to slow myself down, but it's not that easy. Okay, the sun with the outer. Okay, so one is over there and the other one is going to go there. Perfect. Oh, the sun and the moon. Okay, new dungeon. I discovered the vault. All right, so there are two Let me guess, I need to have the right orientation there? Oh, it's alright. I'm going to guess. And I'm going to guess that I need this on this side and that on the other side. Yep. 
because he comes the sun. I see. It's all right. Do, 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 do. Oh, I just got the key like that. Okay, so basically I went through probably all the other dungeons because it took me a, a little while to understand um, that I needed to use the torch in order to be able to use every single um, button or plate that I encountered. Okay, so back to the lighthouse now. I'm guessing. But I'm still missing the last piece. Hello, little wanderer. You took your time. Were you per perhaps led astray? Or just followed by the slow one? I think his name is Medvin. Slowest few shifter I have met, but sharp, intelligent. Do you know what it is you found? You hold both light and key to lead you into the twilight. Both dusk and down, I believe. Southwest of here is a temple, the silhouette of setting sun. You will find more answers there, Conal, but faster than Melvin. Southwest, okay. Secrets await you in the deep. Seek counsel from the ones who slumber. Cool, thank you. Thank you, Fox. Southwest. This direction. Okay. Well, I already activated this. Okay. That wasn't there. Ah, we are getting back to the, um, the half area that at the very beginning of the game I stopped next to. Yes. And now there are a lot of people around here. Before reading. Let's open the temple. Okay, cool. I mean, it's probably not ideal for the trees themselves, but... Uh... It looked awesome. We made it. We'll be safe here. Something tells me that maybe not. To go up. Are people helping other people? I'm guessing I can read the tablet here, right? Yes. The twilight garden opened her eyes at the light of sun and moon shining together. She sat down and calmly took both in her sky hand, bringing balance to light and shadow. With her right hand, she released the sun to let people back from the dream. With her left, she flings the moon into the night sky so that people may dream at all. She is the heartbeat of the seasons at the center of the world, the breath of life, and order. She seems nice enough. Let me go in that direction. Usually when you have like small areas like this, there's something. And there is nothing. 
Uh, well, there's a shortcut to the beginning. Good to know, good to know. Ooh, ooh. Neat. Okay, I can probably jump on this thing. Can I even? No, that is too far. I think we need to go all the way around. Those people are standing there. There are people by the mushroom or that. Mana's paws that cannot run, but chases long, longingly the sun. Mana's wing that cannot fly, but he will always seek the sky. Mana's eyes that cannot see, but watch eternity. Man is lost, unknowingly in danger, to his own mind, as always a stranger. It's a neat relay. I always find that those fishes shouldn't be jumping as high and probably they are having a very bad time. It's it's very shallow. Okay, so there is a button over there. I'm going to go press the button over there. There's another one. Ah, so there's four to open the door. Um, I'm going to come back because I'm guessing that probably up the, those stairs there is one. Oh, there's some writing. Part one. I am Kara of the Thunder Islands. I had a strange dream that I will record here so that others may perhaps understand its meaning as I did. I had come to study the holy carvings and lighthouse in the land of gods, trying to understand our heritage. As I reached out to touch some of the runes, it suddenly felt as if a warm hand passed over my eyes, and I fell asleep on the sec sacred stone. In my dream, it seems to me that the stone beneath me glowed from within, forming a staircase up into the starry night, a uh, starry sky, sorry. Far away on the steps, a golden light grew and drew close. Star flew from the sky and became someone who had the shape of music and was gentle and sad. The gods spoke to me, not in words, but in memories and feelings. He warned me of a terrible greed from beyond, a void in the heart of man. As he showed it to me, I felt it steer and come between us, darkening the golden steps like a storm cloud cold as eternity. Terrified, I cried out at the pull of his dark void and I woke. I could not speak for three days, but I set out to the ancient tem temples immediately. If what I have seen is true, the gods are alive and they need our help as we need theirs. Man. She had seen some shit. Okay, let's jump over there and continue then. Maybe there is four of those switches over there. Yeah, this seems to be cool. Oop. Thank you very much. Oh, I need five. <laughs> 
Oh, but there's one one extra one on top of there. Uh, can I even? Maybe on the other side. Maybe I need to be patient. Maybe I just need to jump around. Jump up, jump up, and get down. Jump, 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 jump. For some reason now I want Christopher Walken just reading seriously the lyrics of most of it. I know that he has made a video at some point where he was just reading a song lyrics. I don't remember which one it was. But it was good. Okay, is that something that I need to jump from here? What? That felt weird. I should have stayed over there. Okay, I'm going to glide here. But it feels like I can normally get over there, right? Ah, there is a tunnel there. I didn't see it. Okay. I can jump from up there. Ooh, no. Please don't don't fall. If you're wondering why I cannot transform, it's because inside you cannot become a bird for some reason. Uh, in any interior. Well, I guess it kind of makes sense development-wise, because otherwise it would have been a nightmare. But lore-wise, I don't know if there is a, a reason for that. Um, going to jump there. Yep. If I jumped on the other side, I would have probably fell. And we would have had to jump a little bit longer to get up. But it's fine. Everything is very relaxing now. Let's have a bridge. Ah, oh, a stairway. Oh, need, now I need to activate the other side. I need probably to get back down. Oh, but then is there an access on this side? Maybe? Just to have an access to the right? Or maybe a tunnel of some sort? No, doesn't seem like it. So I'm just going to come back. Oh, there seemed to be a bridge up there. Yes, there is. Okay, there is a bridge. But is there something I can access from here that I didn't see? Doesn't feel like it, right? Oh. But there is something that goes down over there. Let's go, let's go investigate. Right? Oh, so if I come back, this comes back. If I get close to them, they go higher. Oops. I'm just going to guess that I can potentially... Oh. I see. So I need to go without fear. That's practically this. What the game was trying to tell me. Nice. Oh. I can probably open this in order to come back from the other side, right? Yes. That's indeed. Indeed the thought behind this. And then I can use the bridge, I guess, upstairs. That looks like it too. Man, it just I should I should look for more of those games that are very artsy in a way, but uh 
also have something to them. Just the wool atmosphere. And it's funny that you have a lot of games that have kind of the same same feel to it to an extent. Same same but different. Okay, what do I have here? There are guys over there. There is a moon door here. So this is a study. Read part one. When the world was still new and the creator had drawn the lands, the spirit animals gathered to talk. A fox said, There are new animals around. They walk on two feet, a crane said. A new bird? The fox shook its head and said, They have no wings. A monkey said, I've seen them too. They are without fur and they cannot climb well. An old said, they fear the night and drive it away with fire. An otter said, they build nest on land, but they are not one with it. A deer said, they are loud and do not know how to walk the woods. A bear said, they are like cubs who do not know the way home. The fox cocked his head and said, yes, that is why we have to help them. I hope that the monkey would say that you need to buy to buy stonks, but that would have been... <laughs> help them? The other animal looks stunned. Yes, the fox said. They might see eternity and they are lost and afraid. They need something to hold on to or they will harm themselves, the lands and us, the fox said. What do you propose? asked a hare. I propose a pact, said the fox. If one of them can talk to us, we we'll offer him the bond with the land. The fox continued, if he accepts, he can take the shape of one of us, the one he made the pact with. And he will be one with the land and still see beyond the veil. And he can guide and guard his people and so. We all, we all will be at peace, said the fox. The other animals saw the wisdom in, his, in this and agreed to it. And so, some humans can become one with the world and the, choos and the chosen were called whisperers. Man, whisperers. Okay, so I guess that I need to have both activated in order to be able to pass. And I'm guessing that if I get to the door and do something, this is not going to do anything here. Yes, correct. So let's let's keep on going towards the mushrooms like any good junkie would do. Um, okay, I have half of the thing which is illuminated there. Is there something in the corner here? No, just mushrooms. Ah, oh, but there is a button there. Okay. Oh. I'm going to guess that... Oh. Either in that direction or in this direction. Okay, this is the moon. Moon, moon, moon. Okay. Okay, so this... Oh! Okay, this moves it, moves it by half. This moves it by a quarter. Oh, well, just like by a, an eighth. This must be moving also by an eighth or something like that. Yes. And this by whatever amount. So can I just do the two eight now? Like nope.
that seems. If I move halfway through it. And I'm going to try the quarter afterwards. I've got to say I'm just brute forcing this one. I'm not really thinking through it. Okay. So that one goes there. Oh. So is there logic to the moon and the sun? That I don't know. Okay, let's let's start with the sun everywhere. And see where we go from there. Okay, so we're over here, right? So if I move only this one, I'm going to move one, that one is going to rotate right again, right? Nope. And what does that one do? Okay, so that one was correct, and it was the other one. I think if I rotate the last one as a sun, then it works. Maybe? Nope. Hmm. Okay, so I just need to find what is the good combination in order to get him on the back one, right? That's the only thing that I want to do. Because if I get it... Okay, I just like, I can not show, but I just like, if it, it, it needs to be the bottom left of the, the screen. If I get it on the bottom left of the screen, then I can use the half one. For some reason, I'm not... Oh, can I just... Hmm. That shouldn't be so complex. Okay, this one is going to go there. This one is going to double in the other direction. Yeah. Now if I moon you, and if I moon you, does that work? Moon? Okay, this is good. That's what I wanted. And if I do this, whatever happens. Fuck. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Brute forcing your way through things is a valid solution in computer science, in math, in physics. Sometimes you can have a clever answer, but hey, sometimes brute forcing is the way to go. And you're being lazy like me. It's a good thing. Nope. Nope. Yes. Nope. Yes. 
Oh. But wait. How do I get to this one? I think I need to get to that. Maybe jumping from the side? I think this might be the answer actually. Let's let's just continue exploring a little bit. Uh, maybe the answer will become clearer as we get we get through it. I'm 99% sure that is going to be the answer though. It looks like it. Excellent. Um, is happening around the mushroom here? Interesting. Oh. Oh, nice. So it's at the back here. All right. All right. And then that rotates the bridge, right? Cool. That V shape reminds me of the, the face of the sort of enemy that we saw leaning in the shadows. Okay, now we activated both. Sun and moon are now activated. I think this is the last piece. So now I'm going to go to the lighthouse. I think I need to go to the lighthouse first. Wow. Ooh. That's cool. Come here, little bird. A very long time ago, your people addressed me as the Twilight Guardian. Sitting at the border of dusk and dawn, ensuring safe travel on the paths to the lands of dreams and back again. Even after the great divide, I was there, watching as your priestess Kara led her people to safe shore here in my temple. A long time have I waited for this moment to come. I have grown weak, but for the power I was lent, tethering me to your world. Listen carefully, little bud. Return to the lighthouse to the southeast by the village of your people. Make the three fragments wall again. I can't see your path from here on, little bud. Emptiness awaits. But we cannot... I have not pressed the button. That one has skipped for some reason. But we cannot wait. the design of those things so much. Oh shit. kind of cool though all right I can walk into the light what more is it to see is there to see in in this okay so the Lighthouse is over there, so it's on top of the settlement. song falls I went a little bit too north let's go southeast 
I think I should start to see the lighthouse soon. Yep. Why am I seeing... Why is there a light over there? That usually means that you can interact with something. Oh no, that was already something existing. Okay. That's the reason why it was like this. Sorry, apologies. Oops. Please fly. Don't don't jump in the void. The void is not a good thing. Alright, the lighthouse is dead ahead. Where is the old man that we left behind? I'm not sure. Let's place the tablet. Oh, everybody is back there. Okay. Oh, they have only four fingers. This is suspiciously looking like a Zelda tri Triforce logo. Okay, and I'm guessing this is shooting directly onto the Guardians, or the... not the Guardian, but the creator's lair, right? Let's talk to them very quickly. Hey. Goodbye for now, Oak. Hope to see you soon again. Blessing be with you, young pilgrim. Hey. I'm not quite sure what's happening, but I think it's all meant for you, Oak. Follow the beam to the crater's shrine. Mm. Oak, are you alright, child? This is eerily similar to the text I translated. The lighthouse shone a brilliant beam. At least it's not another divine. What would... What would we even call it? The greater divide? I don't think your pilgrimage ends here, I'm afraid. Even though you have already gone further than all before you. Whatever it is that you will face at the end of this path, I am confident that you will, as always, come home safely, full of interesting news. You have found out so much, so much I never would have dreamed of understanding of the ancients in our past. Go on now, find out what lies at the end of this light beam, and Oak, please, be careful. What is the kid going to say? Oak, what's happening? Why are you going? Promise to come back? You will have to tell me everything about it. Alright. Deal, kid. Let's get the level of the beam and fly with the beam. <laughs> Flies into the laser, game over. Imagine you're the person of the prophecy that is supposed to follow that great laser of light showing them the path. <laughs> and they just carboni carbonized in two seconds after flying towards it. Okay. Perfect timing. That's quite the loading there. Ah, thank you. Oh, 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 oh. What, what just happened? Was that taking the light 
out that did this? Or... Alright. I guess I need to follow the light now. Did I die already? Oh, wait, listen to me. Do you know me? I'm Kara. Time is short, but I try to explain. You are of my blood. Once the creator infused me with some of his light, his hope and his dreams, his power, at the time of the Great Divide. This power is yours now, Oak. It has saved you from the Void's touch. He's stronger here, however. I will shield you for as long as I can, but we don't have much time. You are about to enter the prison of the Void. This prison is outside of our world, and there I cannot help you at all. Follow me. Man, Kara is MVP. Do you understand, Oak? I am a memory of my old self, and now that I have left the lantern, I will soon fade away. I can only speak to you here and now. There is no turning back. This is the only chance we have. The people of the sky closed their hearts to the void, but it was not enough. He was almost broken free from his prison. We can't stop him from devouring our world. Not without you. You can put an end to what was started so long ago. All right. I always like those speech when they say you're the only one that can save everyone and you trip and die. I am sorry. There are so many things I want to tell you. So many things I would like to ask you. But we don't have the time. These last steps are not for me to wonder. It's up to you now. It's up to what you really are. This door leads to a realm in between our world and eternity. This is where you will find the void. You must finish what the creator started and make whole what was shattered. I know you can do it, Oak. This is goodbye, I'm afraid. I will watch over you with all the might I have left in me. I believe in you. Thanks, Kara. Did I gain a new ability? Okay, my arm is shiny now. What does it mean? It's dark in here. That game kind of reminds me of Journey. It's dark, it's moody. Oh, this is going to set the stage for the thing that is going to light up in the distance, right? Maybe that direction? Can't really walk over there. Okay. Oh, hello there.
I apologize for anybody which is at night now with night mode. <laughs> oh, that that's the end. So that's it. You touch the guy and that's over. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Well, that was a nice little game. All right. I will leave the credits at some point. And see. Who is around. Because now it starts to get the time where having dinner seems like a good idea. And then I'll be back much later man there are a few people that have worked on this game I mean it's still a little bit st staggery which I'm not sure if it's my setup or their stuff it's a little bit it might be the problem now that I come to think of it might be G-Sync I know that in some cases for some games G-Sync can cause some issues um, because they are not expecting to necessarily throw that amount of frames and they're kind of expecting to have a pattern which would be 60 frames um, problem is if you v-sync normally that one solves that problem because it should lock it at 60 in a way is there an after credit thing ah no there isn't all right well i'll get going now uh we are going to say hello to dz pete which is a Finnish streamer, um, which is also a YouTuber making funny content. Um, go say hello to him. Oh, don't just follow what he's doing because it's kind of interesting. And I'll be back later tonight. As always, thanks for joining and see you soon. Ciao.